and welcome. My name is Michelle Willis and this is segment five of How to Conduct. Today we will be talking about the gesture of preparation. When we are wanting an ensemble to start with us, we need to give some kind of preparative gesture to let them know how to begin. I use two ways in order to get them started. The first is using breath in order to breathe with them so they know that we are ready to begin. The other is to give them a preparative gesture in my conducting pattern to let them know that it is time to begin. Typically in conducting what we will use is if you are in a 4-4 time, so you're counting in 4, and your ensemble is coming in on beat 1 of that piece, then you're going to give them the beat before. So if they come in on 1, I want to give them the beat before, which is beat 4, up and then beat 1. So breathe and begin. Breathe and begin. Try that, mirror me. So we'll give the gesture of preparation. One. Again. One. One. Very good. Now, if we had a song such as America the Beautiful, where it begins, Oh Beautiful for Spacious Skies, and comes in before beat one, so in that case it comes in on beat four, then we need to give another gesture before that. So we are going to give beat three as the gesture. So, Oh Beautiful. So see that? They come in on four, so you've got to give the beat before. So start over here. Oh Beautiful. Let's mirror that. Do it with me. Starting at the inside of the body, go out. Oh, beautiful. One more time. Start inside the body. Oh, beautiful. Now let's try one that you know, Joy to the World, that starts on beat one. We're going to give a gesture of preparation starting at beat four so you can breathe with them and then come in. Joy to the world. One more time. Joy to the world. Very good. Just remember, it's always important that when you are starting an ensemble that you make sure that you breathe with them and give them that gesture of preparation so they know where to come in. Mm -hmm.